Good morning, Audacious Church. My name is Aya Kennedy, and I'm part of the Audacious Central Campus. I'm honored to be sharing a devotional with us this morning. And the passage we will be looking at is 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 6 and 7. And it reads, Therefore, I remind you to stir up the gift of God, which is in you by laying of my hands. For God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. This passage is, for, is from Paul's final letter to Timothy from prison before his execution, which concerns that Timothy might face enormous responsibilities in leading the church. As so many of the members were beginning to be disloyal due to the prosecution. He wanted to encourage him to be loyal to the faith because the situation could have left, to, could have left Timothy in a place of fear and of confusion. Fear alerts us of the presence of danger in our day-to-day -day life. And fear could be developed from difficult situations or challenges we face in our life. For instance, losing a job or losing a loved one could create uncertainties and anxiety. Or when things we pray for don't happen as of the time we expect them to. This could also lead to a state of fear. A lot of times, the enemy puts fear into our heart and we sometimes lose our faith. And fear is developed in the, in, in the absence of faith. Paul reminded Timothy in verse 6 to stir up the gift of God in him and let the fire burn in the face of adversities. God has empowered us through the gift of his spirit. He was reminded that he was equipped with the spirit of love, the spirit of power, and the spirit of a sound mind. The spirit of God gives us the spirit of boldness, the courage to live in our identity in Christ. It gives us the spirit of love to, to be Christ-like, to be able to attract and connect with others. The spirit of power, the dynamis to operate in the supernatural, the courage to make things happen, and the spirit of a sound mind. Knowledge and wisdom to grasp the vision and to take the right steps. Whenever our mind is troubled, I'd like to encourage us to stir up the gift of God in our lives and to increase our faith. We should be reminded the power we carry and that is available to us at all times and to be able to exhibit the spirit of power, the spirit of love, and the spirit of a sound mind. I'd like to pray for us today as many that need a relationship with Christ. I pray they have an encounter and be filled with the Holy Spirit and to be able to live a life filled with the gift of God in our lives and be able to be strong and steadfast in all challenges we face. We pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Have a lovely day. Stay blessed.